Egyptian lover, Egyptian lover, Egypt, Egypt. Hi guys, welcome back. So today's video, I'll be trying out the VAMP stamp. The VAMP stamp is a stamp that is supposed to help you achieve a perfect winged eyeliner. The VAMP stamp was uh, created by a woman by the name of Veronica Lorenz, who's a makeup artist. Uh, she was diagnosed with a benign tumor, which left her uh, partly paralyzed. So she had a hard time using her right hand to do uh, makeup. So she invented this, the VAMP stamp. Um, she also invented, actually she was a co-creator of the Beauty Blender, so yeah, so I'm excited to try this. Um, I pre-ordered this all the way, I think it was in November, and I just got it last week. So let's go ahead and open up the box and take a look at it. Well, first look at, let's look at the box. It's a really pretty box. It's foil stamped in the front. It's really, really pretty. And then on the side, there's this beautiful drawing of this woman. It's, it's really pretty. Whenever I get boxes like this, I hate to throw it away. But let's go ahead and open it up. Let's see, there's something here on the side too. On the um, outside, there's a little place that you can open up and it tells you the instructions on how to do it. Now they sell the, um, the gel that goes with it. It's a, a cushion gel, but I didn't get that. Um, you can use any, any kind of um, eyeliner. I'm gonna go ahead and use my liquid eyeliner to coat it. So just take a look at the stamp itself. So there's a right side and then there's a left side. And it's just, uh, it looks like the points, the flick. Okay, so let's get started on the stamp. First thing I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna go ahead and do my right side. So I'm gonna go with the side that has the R. And I'm gonna take my L'Oreal liquid liner and coat the end. I'm hoping this works. I um, if you saw one of my previous videos, I did a um, wing eyeliner stencil, and I don't do I don't usually um, I wear um, wing liner because I really suck at it. So I'm hoping this will be something that'll make it easier for me. So it's just to coat the whole thing. Okay. Now here is the part. Oh, I'm kind of nervous about this. Okay, this is the right. Move my hair. Okay, let's go ahead and try this. Oops, I have it the wrong way. I'm not really sure where to position this. Can you see that? Okay, I'm gonna try one eye at a time. So now I'm gonna go ahead and try and connect that to the top liner. I'm gonna use this again.
it's not too bad. Especially for somebody like me who's really sucks at this. Let's try the other side. So I'm gonna take the left the side that says the L. And I'm gonna coat that with this. I'm so nervous, I don't know why. It just seems like once you stamp it, that's it. Okay, and get this coated. Do a little bit more. Okay, put back the hair on this one. Okay, back to this. I have to put a little bit more. I had to um, do a little break. The rubbish truck decided to come right now. This is not their normal day to be coming down our road, but oh well. Okay, let me add a little bit more. Okay. The left eye. I'm trying to remember exactly you want it to be even. Okay, so that side came out. Okay, let me try. is not as sharp I think it should be but yeah this side is a little bit down compared to this side so it's a little bit lifted Clean this up a little bit. I have this um, e.l.f. makeup remover pen. This is my favorite. It it cleans up mistakes really, really good. Yeah, they're definitely different on each side. I'm trying to think, get it. Let's see what side I like better. I definitely like this side better. So if you want to take a look at it. So what do I think about this product? I think it's a really good product actually. Um, I think um, with a little bit more practice, I think I can get really good at it. I, I think it, it's more of a, a guide, um, especially for someone like me who I just can't do wing eyeliner, um, especially this area here. That's where I always screw up is this part to do the actual flick part, the wing part. So I think this is a really good thing to help you as far as a guide. Um, I'm gonna practice with it a little bit more and I think for me, wing eyeliner and false eyelashes go hand in hand and I don't wear false eyelashes. Um, I only do sometimes for a special occasion, occasion but I don't, I don't usually wear um, false eyelashes. But I'm going to go ahead and try this out with a false eyelash and see what it looks like. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and put, put, put a link down in my description box if you want to get yourself a vamp stamp. If you have any comments, go ahead and put them below. Please don't forget to subscribe. Till next time, bye!